The hood can be used for patients needing some form of non-invasive ventilation, such as high-flow nasal cannula or BiPAP, or for pre-oxygenation of a patient requiring intubation. It's designed to fit on standard ED stretchers, as well as inpatient beds. To put the hood in place, at least two people are needed to help lean the patient and the mattress forward. It is important to note the hood must be placed between the mattress and the bed frame and should be anchored to the top bar of the bed frame. Once in place, an equipment bag can be draped around the frame and the patient. The bag should be draped down to the level of the patient's hips or legs and behind the bed frame. Once the bag is in place, any form of non-invasive therapy can be instituted. If the patient needs to be intubated, before laying the bed back, roll up some of the posterior portion of the bag to give yourself some slack as the bed frame lays back. The entire apparatus will fold back seamlessly with the bed into place. Two holes can then be made at the head of the bag using either shears or a pen to facilitate the insertion of both arms. This helps to keep a continued safety barrier while giving ample room for the provider to comfortably perform the procedure. A second set of hands under the bag will be helpful to facilitate the passage of the glide scope and to hold the ET tube in suction. The frame gives enough room for all manner of equipment and enough clearance for the stylet and ET tube to be moved in any desired axis in order to successfully pass the tube. The frame also helps to keep the bag taut enough to have a clear view of the patient's head and face with no obstructions. Proning can also be achieved using the hood. Once the frame and the bag are in place, the bed can be laid back and the patient can prone onto his stomach. To safely remove the bag, pinch the top of the bag and pull up. With both hands, wring the bag together to ensure the inside of the bag is not being touched or exposed. Roll bag together and discard. If the bed is flat, lift the head of the bed slightly to release the posterior portion of the bag. Pull the bag from the top and wring together as described. Roll the bag together and discard. Clean the hood with hospital wipes and allow appropriate drying time.